Cool, about to start. We got our lights on, and we are about to drop the green flag. There it goes as we take a look back from uh, Luca looking at his teammate there, Maxime. And it looks like Luca got a bad start because Jason Pelter is already out in the first place. First and it place, like and it looks like Maxime's going to be fighting with his teammate for second place. There, we saw a car. It looked like a has go a little wide there, and there is a yellow flag in sector one. So we'll have to see what happened there. But it looks like we got a Mercedes out front, and then the two McLarens are battling back and forth here. The cars coming three. around here, passing the pit lane entrance. We're gonna get a green flag, and we are gonna be led away here by Jason Pelter. Still kind of waiting, still can and there he goes. Definitely a, get, getting a great start once again. So he's getting a little bit of a, a McLaren try to draft each other. Not really working together as a team, kind of Boom. fighting each other. Oh, we got a spin there. Spin for uh, Maxime Bellu. Yeah, that's unfortunate. That's uh, out of turn two. So saw he was getting very, very close. He's definitely got that inside. And into Could Stewart. Be careful, yeah. though. As you heard before from Max Speed, he says he's going to do whatever it takes anyway, so he's not going to yield. You got to do what you got to do. He's running in P5. Good catch there. Nothing gets past you, Michael, and he's looking to get probably the fastest lap on that one. Sensation speed from the Williams driver. Maybe he's thinking about, maybe if I could, if I could drive the pants off this, I'll be promoted to a Mercedes next year. Yeah, Williams I mean, has definitely got some speed in the right hands. Um, speaking of... Oh, Ooh, that's Beam. Uh, that a, yeah, that was an Alpine there. Beam, Beamer NG coming through here, trying to get straight as we see. Chazzy Razzy Gabby. Chazzy Razzy Gabby is going to be now the safety car as we're about to start lap nine of 29 here in Alba Park. What a launch, yeah, too. Look back, it's going to be playing, stressful, yeah. no matter who you are. Ooh, Mercedes gets a little wide. That gives the, the opening here for the, the uh, Aston Martin. He's going to get pushed out wide himself. That one might be a little little one for the judges to take a look at. I'm not sure he gave him any room there. That's just the way it works out for me. Overtaking the turn one. Looks like it's job done for Mr. Carl. Unless that was without the DRS. Yeah, that's absolutely correct. Cody's also putting a bit of pressure back there on Freddy. But we'll see if this pans it to anything else. No, it won't. Well, for Romeo. And I'll tell you what, you're going to look at doing it soon because there's a championship leader just in the background hunting him down. And that's a contact there, wasn't it? Ooh, yeah, it looked like that uh, Alfa Romeo got a little loose there. Freddy had to back out, and he gets past. That's a the free pass right yeah, there by Cody. Fresher tires. Or Cody only has one lap fresher tires, but we know Cody's been real gentle with those tires. He looks the inside, and it looks like the start from P12 up to P1. Looking like that's exactly what he wanted to do tonight. Job done. Because he's already got his switch, so switching to staying on mediums, he knows he's fast. He's going to lose some positions, but... I mean, everybody in front of him right now, except for uh, Fabi, who's on eight laps old tires. Everybody in front of him is going to be on the Ferrari oh. of Fabi and Shea, the Haas, in about two sectors. So about course of 10 turns, I would say. We've got quite a bit going on. The two McLarens coming side by side once again. They have been battling all night Just long. Just got enabled here. We'll take a look back from uh, Fabi. Looking back at those two Mercedes, or I'm sorry, those two McLarens fighting back and forth. Maxime and Luca. Check out behind as well. Yep, and they make a move on the Haas. Yeah, he's able to do so. But the exit speed yep, right here. Bang. Mm -hmm. Open the letter box. Let a bit of air go through there. Make your way up into P2. Cody Lawrence just absolutely flying around oh, this that course. That is a Haas, yeah. Oh! Oh, somebody else has and had to spin the there because they ghosted. Yeah, Jason. That's got to be a safety Jay. car. Oh no. There's the Aston Martin coming out there. You know, so there both of them. There we go. Coming into turn one. Gets a solid start. Maxime, not too far behind. Whoa. Got a great recovery there. And uh, that's the Ferrari into the wall. Able to collect himself. And there's Gabby. And there's a McLaren getting involved in Luca Mer Meridius. Oh, elbows out. Oh, wow. Yeah. And there's Beamer NG, just like you were talking about just a moment ago. That Alpine's trying to uh, take a stab at this action. I believe he did. He's actually on two warnings. One more at the moment. It'll be in that three-second club. Mm. Yeah, so this, this mm. Alfa Romeo is definitely going to have an opportunity to fight for that, that spot, but he's going to have to back out there and Coming oh, close together. Best contact, both of them. Too close. And that looks yeah. like Fluffy Dave has lost the front wing there. I don't see, you know, overtaking turn 9 and 10. No, that's 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 really bold and brave there. Look at the exit speed he can get. 
No DRS is enabled at all that you're going to get for the rest of the race. He has to stick well up the inside here. Trust in your tyres. It does allow enough space on the inside there for the Alfa Romeo, but that's job done. McLaren up at a P3. On the Alfa Romeo. Oh, no, he's in a dummy on the outside, but, but it definitely see he's faster. And you're right. And his teammate's going to spin around, so he is going to be in that P2 eventually, but I'm pretty sure at the moment didn't want to do that. Was that, that contact? Uh, that's, that's definitely going to be uh, bugging him a little bit, but I don't think he's going to lose any sleep over it tonight as he comes through the last two turns. One last time. There's your winner, Cody Lawrence. Absolutely stunning drive tonight. Take the hands, lift the trophy. You'll be lifting probably another trophy soon, Cody Lawrence. Says that, that driver's championship trophy, that championship might very much be wrapped up, but another win, another trophy to your cabinet, and a strange EP winner, Cody Lawrence.